Hello students, this is Sri Ram Shastri. I once again welcome you back to this video session where we can uh, show you, I can show you how to draw the diagram of amphibian and snake in comparative anatomy. So if you talk about amphibian brain, this is a fast drawing technique generally. You can draw amphibian brain beginning with the opti uh, sorry, olfactory structures and then cerebrum, olfactory structures and then cerebrum continuation of cerebrum into the next structures that is it is partitioned as cerebral hemispheres like this okay so the optic lobes you can confirm the olfactory lobes sorry olfactory lobes you can confirm drawing it like this okay so they are partly divided not completely divided structures so you can put this line up to here so up to this region this is cerebrum and these are the olfactory structures it continues like this into optic lobes two optic lobes are there here and in between the optic lobes they have a small pineal body structure okay so you can show it with a shaded structure then below this they are having cerebellum okay so here they are connected to the cerebellum okay this region so this region forms the cerebellum and then continues into the medulla oblongata and spinal cord so this structure forms medulla oblongata and spinal cord so you can label it now if you want or you can continue the labeling after you draw the another diagram of snake so continuing with the video here that is a diagram of a reptile uh, brain so you can continue the reptile brain with the brain of a snake you can take here so here it is starting again with the olfactory bulbs and olfactory tract olfactory lobe then continues as a bulged structure of cerebrum bulge structure of cerebrum so in this depression of cerebrum itself it is having a small pineal body like this okay so now this structures are connected to the lobes called optic lobes okay now below the optic lobes it continues generally with the structure called cerebellum here and this shaded structure is cerebellum cerebellum continues into the medulla and medulla continues as spinal cord so this is the medulla and spinal cord so one thing we can add here that is the bulged bulb like structures here at the end clear so these are the two diagrams this is the amphibian brain and this is amphibian brain you can take example here that is frog this is reptilian brain reptilian brain example you can take snake right so here you can write it directly as olfactory lobe okay so these two regions are olfactory lobe okay here they have extra structures like uh, the olfactory bulb olfactory bulb this is the olfactory tract this is once again same that is cerebrum for both okay so after cerebrum you can uh, take this structure called pineal body so pineal body for both when you are drawing the diagram label it separately just for your understanding i am labeling it uh, this video is mainly regarding how to draw this uh, diagram okay so don't mind if i am uh, labeling it very rough so this is the optic lobe this region is the cerebellum this region sorry this is cerebellum okay this is the medulla and this is the spinal 
record so this completes this video i hope you have understood how to draw the diagrams in a very fast way thank you and in the next video we will continue with the brain of bird and mammal thank you